Hello, my gorgeous friends on the internet. Hello, my gorgeous friends on the internet. Today, we're going to be doing a Reddit redesign challenge in less than 30 minutes. Can you add the three in the O? Yes. 30 minutes. And the whole reason we wanted to do a design video is because next week we want to redesign your projects. So that means designing, coding, just giving a fresh new take on your projects. So send them in to this email. No, down here. Submit it now. And you could be the next one. And wait, start it again. And you could have your project recorded by David. Let's get going. And also check out the coupon code down below for the ultimate React full stack course, because it's still on sale. So get it now, click on it, and let me know if you like it or not. Hopefully you do. You better like it. You better. Okay, let's get into the codes. Not codes, design. So here's currently how Reddit looks like, and there's quite a few things I want to change. First of all, uh, is the side navigation. I'm not too big of a fan of. Uh, it seems quite random with the stuff they have on screen. And I'd really like to have a couple more useful things. One being, in the search, like, if I want to go to a... <laughs> my voice. <laughs> <laughs> Whenever I want to go to a subreddit, I usually just search for it because it's not easily accessible on the screen. So I want to create some kind of card system here where I can just drag and drop different cards in the side panels and have any information that I want to. And I also want to put main emphasis on the actual posts. So let's see what we can come up with. And timer starts now. 30 minutes on the clock, let's go. So the first thing I wanna do, I usually start off all my designs with having a grid system. I just made a little nav here and I chose a grayish color for the background because I want all of these different cards to be white, very similar to similar to Reddit. So what I'm gonna do is just go on this canvas and turn on this uh, layout grid here. So plus on that one and change this to size 12. I always do that and go to a bluish color. And then here I just do columns 12 and then I'm good to go. I can really easily format and place my content on the screen. So I'm gonna try to create some cards right now and we'll see how it goes. Okay, so here's what I came up with. So I'm gonna make all of these card systems here and just plop them in right here. And like in a real world usage, this would be replaceable. So user could customize and add these cards, whether you wanna see your activities, whether you wanna see uh, the all your favorite subreddits, you could just plop them in here. So what I thought about it is that I'll have these cards here with like different sizes and heights. These are gonna plop into these two columns and then optionally you could have more here. And then the main part here would be the posts. So that's gonna be there, all right? So that's kind of the design idea I'm gonna go for. So those are gonna be all the posts just like that. All right, so let's give it a shot. So I want something like this going on here. So here are all the subreddits. Uh, so this is gonna be like a favorite, favorites list. So I'm gonna add the title up here, favorites. And I'm gonna go for a 12 size on this one and also a grayish color like that. So again, all the cards are gonna have kind of like a title up here and whatever content that's gonna flow down here. And here's a cool tip if you wanna organize everything because uh, we wanna have some padding going on here on the left and right. We don't wanna have our content being stuck all the way to the top. If you're not using auto layout, which is a cool new feature, what you can actually do is go here on the the background and add a stroke to it and put it on the inside and then you can add your padding like that so you can do 12 and then you can easily drag this kind of to the end of it like that and then to the top there we go so now you know that's positioned perfectly so if I just get rid of this now or turn off the stroke there's my padding and I can do the same on all the edges so I'm just gonna turn this back on and bump it really big I don't know how much I'm gonna do, maybe 16 or let's do 18. There we go. And then I can easily kind of position my content like that on the screen. It's a bit up like that and boom. Cool, so let's, let's try to finish up this card as soon as possible. 
Okay, so here is the first card system finish. So this is how it looks like. Favorites, and we have all the different subreddits. And then we have a view more button, which would theoretically expand this even more. So that's one. So I'm gonna try to create a couple more that I think would be useful for a user to see. And then hopefully, hopefully it'll look good. I have 20 minutes left. Oh gosh, let's go. Okay, so here are all the cards, so now we can just go up here and plop them in. So let's head up here, and this is our nav, so let's start off with what would make sense. So at the top of the list, I'd like to have my favorites, so let's drop it up here, leave a bit of space, and then let's do activity on the side, and let's also do maybe the top communities. Again, we can kind of reorganize these as we go. So on this side, I want to see kind of information about that specific subreddit. So let's drop that up there. Uh, maybe we can promote our premium. Please tell me what Reddit premium does, because I have no idea. Does anyone actually have premium? I'm, I'm really interested of knowing. Okay. And then we have our notifications and a learn more section. So let's kind of drop them all in here. And here's a cool little, little trick you can do is let me turn this off now that they're all in line and we can turn off the column we can get these cards and then we can hit this button down here and it's gonna boom magically organize it for us and do the spacing and then if we want to change the spacing we can just grab this bar and do maybe 32 pixels between each of them and then i can do the same thing with these ones so click that do 32 and then I can just align them nicely at the top section here. 32 and just move it, holding shift up, puff, till it locks there, pa pa, Locked and loaded, like a magnet. What? <laughs> Before I move on, I need the approval. What? How does it look? Looks great. 10 minutes and I don't even have my posts. What are people even supposed to enjoy on this website? The premium, of course. Okay, so let's quickly throw together a little card here. Uh, a font was activated. Okay, cool. Uh, so let's turn this back on. Just get the sizing really quickly. There we go. And I'll try to come up with something. Okay, card is done. There's five minutes left, so I, I'm not gonna have time to modify these all around. So I'm just gonna do copy paste and maybe do it after the challenge. But there are the Reddit posts right there looking good. We quickly need to drop in the navigation. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do in five minutes, but let's give it a go. So there we go. That's how it looks like. Oh, I also need like the, the damn popular hot and you forgot those. So let's do those really quickly. Call the zoom zoom thing like the zooming thing loop the magnifier, magnifier loop how do you type magnifier no time's up <laughs> I don't know. time's up let's see how far we got that's it pretty far so what i'm gonna do now is make the spacing change the pictures get the nav up and going and then we'll compare it to the original Reddit design. Okay, after tinkering a bit with it, here are the final results. So here's the original Reddit. And here is the remake. Pa! That's a much cooler sound. So what I like about it, again, is just the easy access to all the things that you need in Reddit, at least for my personal use. I always like to have my notification displayed on the screen. That's a lie, I never use that. <laughs> But like the recent subreddits, I always go and search for them. I never, especially on the phone. Um, oh, I guess it wouldn't work on the phone, would it? You wouldn't have the naps. <laughs> no, this is just specific to desktop. Okay, I haven't thought this through, but that's it. That's it. That's my design. Thank you so much for watching. Again, send your 
own designs or websites, I might code them out and design them as well. Who knows? We'll see. And yeah, that's it for me. And from you, say goodbye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs>